Mitchell with uh, the uh, two captains. Uh, it's Kavindu uh, Madara Singapore Royal and Sitara Hapuhin for St. Thomas's. Our match referee is uh, Wendell Labroy and the um, standby umpire is Asanga Jayasurya. Gentlemen, the toss, uh, Sitara Hapuhin will uh, toss it up. And the call from Kavindu Madara Singha. Heads is the call. It's tails. It's tails. And um, congratulations, uh, Sitara. Is that important? What are you going to do? Uh, we are going to have a bat first. Oh, that's a shot. And uh, Sitara rocks back on the back foot. Says, thank you very much. First rounds on the board for St. Thomas's. Teams 9 for no loss after two overs. Again, shot uh, from Rajapaksa. And uh, Sitara repeats. Uh, Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's uh, Sitara Hapuina for you. Just wide of the extra cover fielder, but that will run away to the boundary. Up by the Tomians, a good run rate maintained. Beautifully played by uh, Shalin Dimel through that mid wicket boundary against Pati Ratna. Ball trickling down to the boundary. Playing this uh, Mustangs trophy again, uh, taking on the full good looking shot once again, straight as a dice. Definitely, it's uh, no easy process at all. Ah, oh, it's cleaned him up. That was a loose shot from uh, Shalin Dimel going right across the line. We are looking forward from uh, Madhushanka. Keep it straight. He didn't do this as Tiran mentioned in the big match, but here it is. And uh, Shalin Dimel, he was looking to play that towards the square leg. He should have played it much straighter. Missed it completely. The first wicket down for St. Thomas' 38 for the loss of uh, one wicket game plan today as well. Just short of a length this time, call a no ball. Umpire. Ah, uh, that's what I was just talking about. He targeted that onside, uh, Tiran. I saw him just looking towards the onside. Yes, Roshan, I think it will be after the. After about 12 o'clock, we'll see the crowd coming in. So that's nicely uh, swept away to the fine leg boundary. So that's another four for St. Thomas. Coming in from the Torrington end. This time nicely put away, clipped away to the fine leg boundary. So Sitara Hapuin, uh, as we were discussing, gets, his, get another, gets another four. He's coming in right arm over from the Torrington end. Ryan Fernando open space, but it's a big nick. And that runs down to the third man boundary. So that's another four for him. And, um, it's a good delivery, but uh, equally well played by Hapuina. That's running down to the boundary, and that will have the legs to take it uh, all the way. Uh, this is uh, very neatly uh, paddled around by uh, Sitra Hapuina. That's not good fielding down in the deep. I think that's Gishan uh, Balasurya. Turn on that occasion. That's 50 for the Thomian captain as he drives it down the ground. Coming off just 63 balls, but uh, very well played. Uh, Half an hour or so. St. Thomas will be looking for one batsman to bat through the overs for few. Short. Short. Uh, this has been uh, pulled up. Uh, has it gone all the way? It's been pulled in. That's a brilliant catch uh, down at deep mid wicket. That could be the game changer, uh, Garmini, because this is type. This is the type of catch. It's uh, Titira. That's uh, Sena Ratna Tevindu who missed out in the third uh, three-day game. That was very well hit. But look at this for a catch. He mischarged it for uh, the first five yeah. seconds, I think. Didn't really get under it, but he had to do the hard work after that. But good hands, got the hands in the correct place at the end. This time he looks to go over the top. That's a stylish stroke from uh, Ryan Fernando. That's the one they waited for. And that's a good strike indeed. That's a wild heave from uh, Ravindu De Silva. Pretty sure the Thomans didn't expect that from that. He was gone for all money. No doubt uh, in the minds of umpire Ravindra Vimala Siri. Over the wicket. Both Ryan who flicks it off his pads. Beautifully played. Short mid off, a short uh, fine leg and no chance. And the first delivery, very cheeky there by Umanga Suarez. That's running down to the boundary. Considering how fast this outfield is, yes, that reaches the boundary forward to in the future. And this time short and pulled away by Ryan Fernando. That's gone to the boundary and that takes him to 49. Good pressure, good attack. 
and that's, that's 50 and for young Ryan Fernando. What an impressive Royal Tomian series he's having. He's making the bad talk as he clearly mentions that to his dressing room. The camp is very happy. You see a happy Tomian camp. Fernando, despite living a dangerous life, gave a few chances, has managed to go to 50. Young, young Fernando by Fernando. And the next delivery, he comes down the track, spots the mid-off mid fielder in the circle and goes over. Beautiful shot. This time a chance for Royal and this time they hold on to it and that's a timely breakthrough for the Royalists. That's a full toss that could have been deposited anywhere. But the batsman just deciding to hit it down the man's throat at mid-on. Very simple catch in the end and as you said Royal will be relieved because the catch has got stuck. Many chances dropped but this time, well that tells you a story. That definitely tells you a story because he knows that he's, he's missed out on a gift. So St. Thomas is 150 for 4, Ryan Fernando. He's missed out on a scoring opportunity but he gets a single. They're looking for a second once again. This is a chance but the throw has gone to the wrong end. And this more runs. Poor cricket. Really poor cricket by St. Thomas. A royal, I should say. Comedy of errors. Comedy of errors. Looks like that would not happen. But if they get to 240, from here they would be happy. Oh, miss it. Sometimes it hurts. Two fielders after it, they can't get to it for. Again, another chance of a run out. This time, Roy will make use of that one. Both batsmen stranded on one side. So St. Thomas is losing their fourth wicket. And that was Umyanga Suarez. That's not a good one for St. Thomas, but certainly a good one for Royal. He started running straight away. Um, difficult to say whose call it was. Uh, the usual story is if it is uh, behind uh, the square cover, it's the non-striker's call, never mind. Well played. That's an important milestone for the youngster. Umayanga Suarez, 50 in the three-day game, 50 in the one-day game. Yeah, he was a judge, the best batsman, wasn't he, in the three-day game, and uh, he has carried on that form. Good to see. Yeah, certainly a good prospect for um, St. Thomas's 43rd over. Sonal Amarasekar got figures of one for 44. Round the wicket. That's lucky. That's lucky. It's hard on the bowler. They go at 7 over from now, they get to close to 240. Beautiful square cut from Suarez. The fielder there at cover point just got. Kalana Perai desperately trying to get under one, but this one was a miss hit towards square leg. There is no fielder there. And this time uh, Kalana Perra goes big and he's uh, gone over. This time, uh, Umeanga Suarez. Uh, Suarez uh, tr goes inside out this time and gets a boundary. Very well played from uh, Umeanga Suarez. Oh, Kalina Pereira has launched that one. Has it cleared the ropes? Yes, it is. Wild swing from uh, Suarez. Uh, and that will earn him another boundary. Really supported the uh, ball as well. The final one. This could be wide. Oh, it is uh, called wide and it's run out. I think Suarez didn't see the umpire's signal. Or maybe he saw it. He thought Kalina Pereira will come through for a run. But Kalina Pereira didn't. Decent over from uh, Pajaratna. Yes, uh, missed it completely. Uh, probably they could have gone if Kalina Pereira went in the first instance. Nothing to lose there. But uh, because of a wide, probably, Kalna Pereira didn't go for it. But very well played, Umeanga Suarez. Fantastic innings uh, once again uh, for St. Thomas in this 41, 44th one day. There oh. you go, and he's missed it right in the block hole there. Kalna Pereira will be disappointed. He didn't get that away for runs. Well bowled coming to Pati Ratna. SSC grounds here in Colombo. This is the uh, Tomian batting card, if you look at it. Uh, 
Shalin Dimel, uh, Ravindu De Silva and uh, Shamil Vikrama Tilaka. Next prize, there was one free hit as well. Kavin the Pati Ratna bowled that uh, good last over. 7 overs done for 39. Watching this game, it's going to be a very interesting chase. Good uh, accuracy. This is the edge found and a good grab in the slips. And guess who's among the wickets again? It's Kalana uh, Pereira. Yes, and was that Shalin Dimel in the uh, slip corner? Shalin Dimel was brilliant in the slips uh, in the big match. Second slip. Oh, it went quickly to him. Held on really well. It has not worked uh, for Royal. They tried something dif different. They wanted the. Uh, oh, it's a. That's a beautiful stroke. Ah, and Vikram Singh, what a stroke to get off the mark. Yes, sir. St. Dom's scored 255. That's a classy stroke once again. Ahan Vikram Singh is running down to the boundary. And that's the second boundary for Vikram Singh. In the middle of the innings, it's not easy for a schoolboy. That's a beautiful, beautiful shot. That's uh, probably the shot of the inning so far. Ahan Vikram Singh. Oh. That is not the place he needs to bowl. There was a risk involved, but Madhar Singer used his bottom hand to great effect to chip it over square leg for a boundary. This one was short and it was there to be hit. Madhar Singer accepted with both hands. That was a beautiful square card. It's not going to be an easy task, Garmini. Oh, this one is played over mid on. What a wonderful shot by Kavindu Madhar Singer, showing a great sense of aggression. And that's gone all the way for six. That's the first six of the Royal Innings. Really read the game and play accordingly. Uh, beautiful shot. This once again. That's over the bowlers, over the field, over Midoff's head. That's race down to the boundary for four. It's not only the boundary that's going to win this match for you. Miss it. Oh, got enough. Got enough. And he's a tall man, my new Pereira. Interestingly, Oh, this is once again shot and pulled over mid on. That too has run to the boundary. This is very good batting by Kavindu Madhara Singh and not allowing the ball to settle down. Yeah, you need to trust your skills and Madhara Singh had the execution. This one knew exactly what he was doing again. Wheeler was brought from the offside. He scooped it over point. Well, that has gone to the boundary line. Pereira. Oh, it's a thundering six. That's Madara Singer's 50, uh, Harita. That's a brilliant shot. That's a captain in control of things. Kalana Pereira, go fetch the ball. A solid partnership of 89 runs for the second wicket. And he's out the very next the ball. Oh, no. I thought that was highly unnecessary by Madara Singer, having got to his 50. This is what uh, Siddhar Hapuina wanted. This is what Dinesh Kumar Singh wanted. This is what Kalana Pereira has produced. Yes, that was... Uh, it's nothing special about that delivery. It's just that uh, Madara Singh was in flow, in full flight. Couldn't help himself, I think, uh, Harita. But that's a big one uh, for all to lose at this stage because as we saw with the Tomian innings, easy to get uh, runs on the track. It's a good stroke. Oh, what a stroke magnificent from. shot by Ahan Vikramasinghe. Probably the shot of the match. Not easy playing that on drive against the turn. Did not continue to bowl. He ended up only bowling six overs. Next one, I think he is comprehensively beaten. Oh, oh Kalana making a valiant attempt there, but uh, probably getting his knee stuck onto the ground, and he is actually on the ground. Nine. Yeah, most certainly, uh, you want to put the pressure and as I mentioned, he's now comfortably crossed over for a single. He punches the air in absolute satisfaction. He's been waiting for it. He's had a wonderful season, I must say. Roscoe has got uh, nearly 700 runs. Missed out in the Royal Thomian. But he's made amends for it with a very gutty 50. The SSC is a big... Uh Crown and oh, that's speak, beautiful. That's that beautiful. is excellent uh, improvisation from uh, Ahan Vikramasinghe. So this is uh, the uh, BMICH or the Bandara. And this time uh, it's Ahan going aerial and over the mid-wicket region. He was eyeing that gap for a long time. Which has uh, come off on 92 deliveries. Ahan uh, Vikramasinghe whips that off his presence. 
Good shot, walked across his uh, stumps, took it on the full. He knew uh, there was a big gap at uh, mid-wicket. Which is good news for all. But he has to keep uh, doing that. This time goes across the line. Oh, that's brilliant. That's absolutely brilliant. Ahan Vikramasinghe could not clear the mid-on field. The intention was good, but just not uh, could not execute it uh, right. He didn't get his time in right, probably the bottom of the bat. But that was an excellent catch. What a catch. I think he, the batsman didn't uh, connect it cleanly, but the only person who got the timing right was the fielder. Uh, Kishan Munasinghe, we have been uh, told. What a catch. That was perfect, I think, Ahan. The final delivery. He's the way on the offside. Oh, and he's gone, is it? Is he gone? That's out. Sena Ratna departs. Just one delivery. Played a powerful drive towards point. Wanted that single. That was straight at cover point. Beautifully fielded again. That has been the difference to me, Ricky Sims. Uh, we didn't wait for the third umpire. It was a relatively easy decision in the end. That, uh, visited last month. Yes, sir. That's uh, very well played. This time, though, through the offside. That's a spanking boundary. That went uh, like a rocket uh, to the boundary uh, line certainly the field now set a bit deep even inside the circle right on that uh, 30 yard circle at the moment all the fielders just uh, trying to save runs oh, oh, oh. oh once again i think is out by yards uh, the umpire goes uh, to the third umpire umpire gamini this i think he's given out yes the red light has been pressed the batsman has been asked to depart a lot of deliberation, but Ampa Hemanth Bhutaj has finally decided that uh, Sonal Amarsekar has to go run out uh, for seven. Come into bat. So this time he connects and he connects cleanly. <laughs> Needs to finish off this over well. Kamil Mishara once again goes back. Gives himself some room. That is even better. That is even better. I thought that was much closer to his body. Gave himself some room. Wide slash and and that brings the end of Kaushan's innings. Wide ball slashed straight to square cover. And uh, Shannon Fernando picks up his first wicket. This is easy uh, catch. Yeah, so Royal lose their sixth wicket, seventh wicket is it? Kalna to Kamil Mishara. Left arm over the wicket and Mishara plays. Uh, deal that scoop as uh, just shot to the fine leg boundary. Royal needs 70 or 49 balls as Kana comes in. Balls the ball short and cut wide and cut hard to the cover boundary. Tomins has slowly picked them back. Oh, he's made it happen again. Shannon Fernando is turning out to be virtually unplayable lot of celebration right round it's a it's a very good gathering for a limited over encounter so once again royal not up to the task they lose their seventh wicket he's got it through massive shot both says at the moment This time goes for the more conventional sweep and he's uh, found the gap. Very good. That's oh. a massive hit. Brilliant. Six. Lairu Madhushanka can always make uh, a telling blow. Ryan Fernando and Umayanga. Suar is making two. Oh, another, another big one. As he it's got over. A bit. Six more. Over long on. Valiant attempt on the boundary line. But Suar is troubled. Uh, 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 Kamil Mishara, full toss this time. Is that out of the park? What a hit! It's out of here. It's out of here. But Kalanapeta has the experience. Full toss on the pads. That should be a boundary. Oh, nobody there. Nobody there. Poor ball in Kalana Pereira. Kalana. Short this time. Pulled. Pulled well. Kamil oh. Mishara. They have done well so far. Royal have to bat sensibly. Oh, he's missed it. That should have been dispatched out of the park. 
Han oh. Der vil sige Kamel Mishara Mist Oh dear As luck gone St. Thomas's way Shannon Fernando He himself cannot believe it His bowler short delivery That was uh, rushed on to Kamil Mishara Probably Too full To play that pull shot Missed it completely Ahead of Royal Oh that's out That's out That's Plum in front He missed it Shannon Fernando The golden arm Straight through the quicker one Manula Pereira didn't know much about it Well we thought Shannon Fernando should not bowl But Sitara Hapuhinna The captain Had faith in his left arm And he's delivered Oh that was Plum That was Plum as it gets Manula Pereira had no clue I think he'll try the flu, uh, fuller one oh, And he's hit it Oh my god He's hit it Full swing of the bat. And where has that gone to? Is it out of here? Is it lost? That's another, another big hit. Kalana Pereira. That delivery is out of the park again. Does not matter where you bowl, what you bowl. With whatever hand you bowl, I'm going to hit you out of here. He's hit him for another six. Sensible. He runs in. Lahiru Madhushanka He needs that single he, Is he going to come back for two? Is he going to come back for two? He's yes, tied he the is. game The he, game has been tied What an innings This is a special one from Lahiru Madhushanka I'll tell you What a game Lahiru Madhushanka Sixth consecutive year Can Lahiru finish it? Lahiru does it for all What a win What a game Oh. Lahiru Madhushanka, 17 deliveries, 46, wins it for all. Wow, what a game. No words uh, to express, uh, Feroz. Uh, no words to express. Uh, what a fantastic innings by the young man. I mean, he's uh, taken St. Thomas apart. He's taken Kalana Pereira apart. He made him both spinners. He's hit him for five sixes. Six sixes in that innings. Look how things can change. Cricket is a leveler. Cricket is a leveler. As you see, St. Thomas has won the toss, elected to bat first, 255 for 6 in their 50 overs. They thought they had enough. Human Gatsuris, Suarez, another half century, fantastic 81. Salt, but also a tie in the series. The Mustangs trophy to Royal College, as we call upon the captain, Kavidumara Rasinga, for a splendid one wicket victory. Well done, Royal. They stopped St. Thomas is on the track after five straight wins. We congratulate Royal. We thank our presenters. We thank Dialogue for powering the big match once again.